The United States made great strides in several sports at the Paris Olympics, tying China with 40 gold medals and blowing everyone away for the lead in total medals with 126. But it's stunningly regressed in a place that it historically thrives in the pool. While there are still a number of American standouts in swimming, much of the headlines were being stolen by competitors from other countries. With the U.S. moving further away from Michael Phelps and Katie Ledecky and Caleb Dressel possibly entering the twilight of their respective careers, there is a risk of falling behind other countries, namely Australia. A new person will be tasked with leading the United States through this pivotal era. After a disappointing Paris Games for Team USA in the pool, Lindsay Mantenko, the managing director of the national team at USA Swimming, has announced resignation from her position effective September 20, 2024, NBC Sports' Nicole Auerbach reported on Friday. Mintenko, who most people will know by the maiden name Benko, is a two-time Olympics gold medalist and has served in the managing director position since 2017. Despite her departure, the former USC star and assistant coach plans to be just as emotionally invested in the sport. I am grateful for the opportunity to serve the athletes and coaches of USA Swimming and will forever be proud of their accomplishments, Mintenko said in a statement via Nikki Warner. I learn from them every day from the 2006 Pan Pacific Championships trip to the 2024 Olympic Games. I will now be the loudest one in the stands cheering for the athletes and coaches who have inspired so many people. There were plenty of positives to come out of the American pool during the last several years, culminating with multiple triumphs in Paris. Ledecky added to her unparalleled legacy in long-distance swimming, while 21-year-old Tori Husk arguably cemented herself as the United States' best overall female swimmer today after earning three gold medals. Reagan Smith continues to be a pillar of consistency in the backstroke, despite falling to legend Kaylee McEwen of Australia. Where the decline is evident, though, is on the men's side. If not for Bobby Finca's world record-setting win in the 1,500-meter freestyle on the final night of competition, the U.S. would have failed to win a male individual swimming gold medal in the Olympics for the first time since 1900. That is incredibly difficult to comprehend. Husk has the ability to lead the women at the Los Angeles Olympics in 2028, but it is unclear who will be carrying the mantle for the men. With phenomenal Frenchman Leon Marchand beginning what could be a terrifying run of dominance, the Americans will look to one of their own to keep pace. It will be up to Lindsay Mantenko's successor to foster the growth of new stars in both men's and women's swimming. Underachieving on U.S. soil is not something anyone wants to endure. Like Clutch Points content? Be sure to follow us. The post-USA swim team director resigns after disappointing Olympics run appeared first on Clutch Points. Don't forget like, share, subscribe my channel Babu Das News.